Hey babies, what's up my darling MVPs and how are you all doing? Welcome back to Sale with Mimi Shosli Mimi where you get the gist. I see they do waiting, I see they hurt. Of course you know there is no sleeping on a bicycle on this channel if it snows you do what? You lose. Are you yet to subscribe to this channel? Or are you still sitting on a fat, long thing? Kindly pause right there. Subscribe. And make sure you turn on the notification bell. If not, tell me. How do you want to get the gist brewing from the cooking pot? Like, how do you want to get the gist? I see the hot, guys. Hey, like I always say. Wahala be like waiting, wahala be like bicycle because what? Tell me why on a normal day Rachel would want to post something like this. Like biggest kids, some let me say, when I say biggest kids, it would be a disrespect to some of them. So let me say some biggest kids, you know, they try to bring um this biggest um kids name to the mod because people already have this notion of biggest kids being flamboyant, being um ash ashy, you know what I mean? Ashawo, you know, they see the ladies as ashawo. You know, and then some of them keep proving that so as in they they see them as a shower go digger and all of that. And then there are some of biggest kids that would give people the reason to always think that whatever people say about them is truth. One of those things are this just look at Rachel, one of the riders during the was final season again. What is final season again? The level up season. Look at what a beautiful damsel wrote. She said as a lady, you can't settle for a man with 800k as salary in Lagos. One wig and your man's salary is finished, baby girl. And then trust the um what's it called? <laughs> trust um people now to come for her. They like, actually pounced on her. Let's just read some before we continue because you see this particular video, just plenty, like just yakwa. So you just have to watch to the very end because as usual, I saved the best for the last. All right, coming from a matter of Lagos. Out of every productive thing you can think of, it is weak that comes to your brain. No investment plan or idea or how the 800k can multiply in few months. Just weeks, vibes, and inshallah. Later, you will come and be forming in the mouth that forming in the mouth that men are not talking, are not taking you serious. Spend the afternoon being watching my favorite TV show. Who else loves? Okay, let me pass that one. Wearing wig of 800k, but inside your brain, nothing. She she were any but when okay she were any this one is Yoruba meaning that are all of you crazy buying expensive wigs on top hair that is not productive is a waste of resources. If as a woman you can't settle for a man who receives eight hundred k because your wig costs more than that, then you don't need wig but brain transplant. <laughs> Omg. There are some tweets you see and you just go, oh, it, it gets blue tick, meaning that she's looking for Elon Musk's money. But sincerely, that one thing, just does, I don't even know how to put it. It doesn't make any sense at all. Yeah, Allah, merge me with the best of women, not this one that has wig as first thought of investment. Is there nothing inside your head aside that wig? I agree because you will also be needing a brain transplant. Clearly, the current one is not working. This is a letter of appointment showing a Nigerian government worker on grade 7 receiving less than 30,000 naira for a full month as salary. But according to Rachel on Twitter, 800k salary is too small. Nigeria is too poor for the level of classism that exists. Anyways, guys, they've been coming for Rachel back to back. They've been calling her names and all of that. But I think that is what she really wants. She needed to trend. Hence, she posted that. On to the next one. So my posted said not to carry these cards, go obal in the market them, go hunt those big rats because them to the chop, especially Stormy and Luca. And then someone said, How many are they? Me too, I want to know. How many cards are you keeping? I also want to know. Because I thought it's only Stormy, but right now I'm seeing another cat with Stormy. Omo, um, nobody falls to that buy cat, so but you must you must actually feed them. I am in support of you taking Stormy and Luca there because you can't be taking up 
taking care of husband and wife. Soon now they will give birth in your house and expenses will be much. I beg they should hustle for their family. But why do you have many though? Exactly. Cats where una supposed to they do exclusive breastfeeding for una rush go give them food. Anyways, I think maybe the other cat belongs to someone else. I do not think Soma purchased another cat. Meanwhile, while we were talking about the cat, Angel has this to say. She posted a video of a cat and then said, Soon, as it is my turn to have stormy, I'm showing her this video and putting her into the work for into the workforce. When I saw all of this, I'm like, it is how these people, you know, we are of uh, like human beings, we are different, and we see some people doing some things like yoke. How do these people do this thing? Because I'm still thinking of how these people could have a cat as a pet. Because I do not like him. Oh my god, I'm so scared of cats. I'm still talking about cats. So Angel has seen another one posted a video of a, a goat hopping, you know, play with a kid. And Angel said, I want a baby goat. So I'm like, Angel, oh, my can you share again, ma? <laughs> Do you know what that means? I'm like, Angel is like, your head is all correct. Which one did you want? A goat. Is goat also a pet, you know? Floxy said, Aki, it's time to buy goat for our queen, you know? Them never fit care for stomach finish now. Goats, if I give her back hand, eh? Oh, my choco. <laughs> Angel is a case. I know she was joking with the goat, though. And then, Soma, okay, yes. Soma said, you all seen what Venita did on that Magneto's new jam. Too mad. And then, Abob Tech said she had all time to come up with better lines she could have she could have but thought it was a task with limited time to execute she tried by doing her best but she shouldn't try it again <laughs> so guys i remember the other time i shared with you all on venita's um how do i put it the should I call it a remix of Magneto's song where she rapped and I brought it here and like biggest kids, all of them are singing now, guys. Since the day I posted that video till now, they've been dragging Venita by her forehead. Like they've been dragging her back to back. They said, who sent you go sing this kind of thing? Almost singing is not for everybody. They were dragging her like I'm like, yo, you guys should take it easy at least. I'm telling you, they've been dragging her back to back. Oh, Mona, wow. As you can see, this person says she should not even try it again. <laughs> you guys are not nice at all on the social space. You guys are not nice at all. And then Venita said, I am never going to feel bad about being sexy and being a mother. In fact, I am like fine wine. I have gotten better with time. And then Chin Chin said, Dear Venita, don't you ever remove your feet from their necks. Thanks and God bless. Meanwhile, they were actually body shaming her on that particular video too. Because if you've seen that video with the way she's dressed, she actually put a phone in between her, her down below, you know, then while she was singing. But whatever. Still talking about Venita. You know, they said when they said, who are you? God um, keep showing them the reason to know who you are as congratulations as we pouring in for Veni or you know as an influencer for checkers costa so she posted this beautiful video you know of course she's so beautiful so her making that advert was just lightening the place and the costa is yellow and she is yellow everything yellow so everywhere was just sparkling and then the venita stands has actually been celebrating her but first off she posted and said as a big foodie food that comes attached with childhood memories are the best that's why at checkers custard forever remains my number one custard meal so when she posted this um the venita stands as the unicorns have been celebrating their faith they said venita this year is just for venita that venita has been making them proud in fact they littered the whole social space with checkers custard they went to purchase it they went to buy just because of venita let's see some of them she is doing absolutely well for herself about influencer venita and checkers custard multi-talented venita the unicorn effect guys there's one thing we're not going to change from venita she is multi-talented even as much as i might not accept right that music is not for her right i might not say oh music is for her but i think she is multi-talented yes my president venita said it's checkers custard Wait, okay, it's checkers custard way, so you already know the vibe. See, they started buying checkers. In fact, the fans went on a challenge where they bought checkers custard and they started posting it on their on the TL. You go to TL, you just be seeing custard, 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 checkers everywhere, everywhere. I'm like, yo, the love is real. Because if not, tell me what else. How do you know love is real? Is when you support the people you call your fave, that you love them. This is how to show it. Especially after a long time when they leave the show and you still see the fans keep coming true for them. If you are not using Checkers Custard, you are wrong. Venita and Checkers Custard, multi talented Venita. This is the hashtag they've been using Venita's and um, Checkers Custard, multi talented Venita, the unicorn.
effect so i'm very sure no matter the drugs venita is getting right now you know no matter how they've been dragging her from left right and center if she turns to the middle you know if she focus and then see the unicorn hyping her what else does she want mm -mm. what else does she want imagine them going to buy costard venita said it is checkers costard guys and you just see them buying it because of her not because of the only before, not because of it's in their house before. They went to buy it. They went to purchase this thingy because of their faves is actually influencing the brand. I bought because I love Venita. She is my baby's baby. Oh, this is so sweet. This is really, really so sweet. Meanwhile, there is Indo Suimi, that is the naysayers, said, This one's no get better thing to do with their life. So you went there, you that have better thing to do with your life. You went there to screenshot people celebrating someone. Like, they did not call on you. They did not mention your name or anything. And you went to screenshot their congratulatory message. When they try. Anyways, Venita has this to say. She said, I am already loved. I am already chosen. I know who I am. I know what you have spoken. That is enough. And then Smart said, okay. And then Chloe said, who God has blessed, no man can curse. Keep winning, my queen. And that's on what? On poor. If God said this is you, people would just talk. People would definitely talk. But God, being God, will keep on doing his own. That's why I keep saying this, my favorite slogan, that thank God, man no be God. Anyways, in all of that, Venita has been trending. As you can see, all he said, Venita trending as always. This is a very big deal. Congratulations again. And then she said thank you. And that is why she's always appearing at, at the, uh, what is it called, the top charts. Amongst the All-Stars housemaid that went for All-Stars season, Venita is the one that appears on top, uh, on top chart the more. So, guys, on to the next one. Mm -hmm. Anyways, the other day, Ilebaye representing her brand, that is the Merinda brand, actually, I think, courtesy of Ilebaye, the mom, they delivered um, Merinda products to an academy and then they showcased the video. They mentioned Ilebaye's name, the winner of All Stars, blah, 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 actually gave us this thing. Ilebaye's mom was the one that represented, you know, understand. And then Ilebaye shared it on her story as she said, Oh, thank you, mom. You know, meanwhile, talking about Baye and Merinda, this is also related. So they've been dragging Ile Baye. You remember um, when they um, they influenced the Merinda brand? There were three, she, Prissy, and the guy. So the girl, Prissy, celebrated her birthday yesterday, and Ile Baye was present. Guess what Ile Baye was wearing, guys? I don't know where Ile Baye is getting all of this clothes from. I don't know if she's just doing this thing. If she's a social media person, I would say she's doing this thing for clout. But she's not a social media person. It is just her personality. She just enjoys dressing like this. But I think, oh, no, 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 no. Like, hey. <laughs> so they've been dragging her anyways. They've been dragging her back to back. All right, guys. This You see, in all of this gist I've been giving you guys on this video, this one is the most shocking one. Coming from Comet Attitude, Giddy Fire is now dating a babe from their level up, but it is not Rachel or Diana. This rumor better not be true, Yazi. Immediately I saw this, I went straight to Giddy Fire's story. And guess what I saw? I saw Giddy Fire, Olivia, and Fina, they went out together. You know, going out together isn't my problem, you know. And then I was like, wait, wait, I don't get. Could it be that? Why, why would people start talking about, um, why would they start sparking a, um, what's it called, dating rumor when they just went out together? Can't um, friends or colleagues go out together? I checked the next story and I saw Giddy Fire, the video, if you watch it was the end, Giddy Fire, um, what was her name? Le I said Liema, Fina's leg was on Giddy Fire's lap and the boy was actually massaging her leg. I'm like, okay. And then the third video was just only Fina. Like Giddy Fire posted only Fina on, on his story. I'm like, hmm, oh more guys. Oh my guys, <laughs> what are we not gonna be seeing on this BB Street, guys? <laughs> well, how I'll be like waiting again, like I always say, well, how I'll be like bicycle. So it's giving, it's like Fina and Giddy Fire are dating. Okay, we are here, we pin, we full ground, we break it. If there is something like that going on, of course, we all know nothing is hidden under the sun. We will definitely find out fully. But, <clears throat> anyways, I will just drop it here. Let me just drop it here. Let me not add anything. I will just drop it here i will see you guys later okay babies i will see you guys soon bye for now and thank you so much for always sailing with me ciao ciao